Hello, my name is Dr. Diwan S. Raja. Today I will discuss about the anatomy of the hemidiaphragm. What is hemidiaphragm? The hemidiaphragm is a clinical condition when a dome of the diaphragm is paralyzed. Okay. That is hemidiaphragm. We have two dome of the diaphragm right dome with the central tendon, the left dome of the diaphragm. We have the left dome of the diaphragm. The right dome of the diaphragm. So right dome of the diaphragm. This is the left dome of the diaphragm. Okay, the two dome diaphragm is the central tendon. Central tendon of the diaphragm. Okay, when one of the dome is paralyzed, the condition is called hemidiaphragm. It may be right dome, maybe left dome. Two dome, if it is paralyzed, people cannot survive because this is the chief muscle of respiration, especially for inspiration purpose. So one side paralysis is called hemidiaphragm. People may survive with one sided dome of the diaphragm. Okay, we got the hemidiaphragm. Now we'll go to explain it what happens in hemidiaphragm. Okay, here is our dome of the diaphragm, another dome of the diaphragm. So each of the dome is supplied by a phrenic nerve here. This is the phrenic nerve, phrenic nerve. This is the left phrenic nerve. This is the right phrenic nerve. Okay, we have left phrenic nerve, right phrenic nerve. If is there any lesion here or maybe left on one side, if there's lesion, this dome of the diaphragm will not move. But this side is healthy side, this dome of the diaphragm will move. During inspiration, this dome will go down. And during inspiration, this dome, because it has lost the capacity to contract its muscle, so intestinal content will push it up. So, suppose in inspiration, this part will go here. But the paralyzed side, which part has section of the phrenic nerve, this part will go up, go up due to the due to the increase in intracranial pressure, intestinal content, abdominal content will push it up to this level. Usually, in a healthy healthy diaphragm during inspiration, both the dome should flatten, should go down. But in case of one-sided section or cut of the phrenic nerve, the, the paralyzed, this part would be paralyzed and this part will go up in inspiration. But the non-paralyzed side or no section or healthy part, dome of the diaphragm, this part goes down in inspiration. So there will be paradoxical movement. of the diaphragm.
here this is paradoxical moment during inspiration it is not going down going up during expiration what will happen this will go up then it will go little down okay so that is the paradoxical movement of the of, because if it is goes up then it uh, everyone pressure will go down so it may go little down okay this is the paradoxical movement of the diaphragm this is called hemi diaphragm okay so due to any reason if there is section here we we'll get or there may be section here we we'll get the same feature on the other side okay so that is hemi diaphragm it was the treatment it was the treatment many years back treatment of tuberculosis tuberculosis before the emergence of or invention of invention or discovery of anti tb drug anti tuberculosis drug so that was one type of treatment idea was that if we do section of a phrenic nerve maybe phrenic nerve section which side has disease if the right lung has disease the physician used to cut the right phrenic nerve if the left lung is diseased because we have lung here lung here okay so if the left lung is diseased then left phrenic nerve should be was section it was practiced by some physician okay in the old time when there was no anti tb drug idea is that due to section lung become inactive there will less aeration okay and uh, there is any type of abscess or damage in the lung that should heal properly because of lack of oxygenation due to section of the phrenic nerve the muscle will be atrophied atrophied and lung will get less oxygen okay so that was the idea of of the phrenic nerve section and making hemi diaphragm arthrogenically but eventually it was found that the benefit is not good or it is doubtful benefit so it is not practiced nowadays for many years because we have a lot of anti tb drug now okay so that's all about the hemi diaphragm if you have any question please feel free to ask me please share the information with your friends and please support my channel subscribe me have a nice day bye now